good morning, good morning, wherever you live in the world. Uh, this is C for Nald, Chris speaking here. I'm looking at some moons. This is back uh, 721. And then I went and looked at the, um, the eclipse the other night, November 19th. You're going to see that in a minute. But I just wanted to get you warmed up on moons. This is pretty extraordinary in this area. I think you'll like it. Um, that'll get your blood boiling. Anyways, welcome to my channel. Subscribe while you have a chance. Um, you might get caught up in this thing and forget to. But anyways, get ready. I'm going to show you this uh, moon I caught. It was a three-hour blood moon uh, eclipse. Supposedly blood moon, but I don't know if I've seen too much blood on my own. Uh, I've seen some reddish stuff, but I, the guy that was doing this had a really hard time with the camera. So be patient with them. My time lapse three hours of... This was like one of the longest eclipses in a long time and I did about three hours of it so it's about two minutes long this right here you see how the the moon just shrinks it goes I, I did it backwards and forwards right here this is going backwards right now but go back and look at that uh, the moon just shrinks and then all of a sudden I went backwards it just makes me say well, what the heck okay keep watching here comes the moon eclipse So folks, what I've been showing you here is the eclipse, but the way he did the, he was trying to catch the filter just right, and it really wasn't throwing a lot of red. So he was trying to adjust his camera to get the red, because I think he thought it should have been red. I don't know, but anyways, it don't matter. I took it, and you know how I love filters, so I enhanced his work, and this is what you get. So enjoy it. Now keep in mind, all this stuff I'm showing you right tonight, or today, or this morning, is from last couple days ago. Now this one you got to think of, Never Ending Story, The Dragon, right? Check it out. This dragon, if, if I mean if God himself didn't give me a little nudge, I would have never seen it. And I did like a thousand times maximize and did his best filter I could. So enjoy this dragon. He'll remind you of the never-ending story. But I also showed my other, my other dragon, um, the red one. And so you could be seeing dragons. Um, sometimes when you take a picture, you see it, but then you don't. Then all of a sudden, whoa. And that's what this was. <laughs> it's crazy, right? <laughs> enjoy it. Well guys, I'm at the point where I have to ask you if you like what I'm doing and you enjoy it, uh, throw a tip down, 
Um, I don't do it too often. I don't ask for money too often. I put up stuff and but I really do need to support to pay my cable and all and I'm not getting anything from YouTube. Probably about a hundred bucks every two months. So thanks for all your support. Just uh, scan that button right on your phone. It'll take you right to your PayPal. And again, I don't do it too often, so I do need to support. Thanks. Also, I want to mention you guys in the Night Galleria. I got to set the, I got to set up so there's a lot of 8K, 4K pictures. Um, it's really kind of an encouragement for you guys to get something for your support. So it doesn't even matter if you use them. It doesn't even matter if you download them. But if you want to download them and share them, you can, and that also supports me because everybody that comes to this channel from your from your sharing. Um, leads them to the channel that's supporting me and sometimes they buy art but I'm just starting it so Christmas is coming I need all the Pinterest shares I can get so all you Pinterest addicts out there share 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 all my different pictures on the night gallery and that's supporting me also so if you never buy nothing just sharing helps me so this is kind of like uh, this is my support video um, fundraiser that lasts about 20 minutes now nah, last about 14 minutes but I'm not gonna talk much about that from now on but as you can see I'm giving myself a shout out support 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 that made you forget about all the news you've been watching and all the crazy stuff in the world but anyways Puff the Magic Dragon is not that friendly it's actually a principality power spiritual wickedness in high places being cast down from heaven Revelation 12 talks about another sign and so tonight I'm showing you another sign um, and I did catch a red one and his eye was so clear and you know, we fight not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, powers, and spiritual wickedness in high places. And this is no game. How do you see it? How do you find a cloud like that? That looks like a dog face dragon. I like his ears. You notice that, right? So, okay. Let's see. I need to snap you out of that fairyland. So, I don't know if you guys seen some of those UFOs that I did. I noticed them. Now, what I'm going to show you next is on fire bill just sent it in and it's going to blow your mind i do not know what it is i don't know how to explain it you tell me wow now phil's the um the sky watcher that catches all the stuff on his telescope that's inside of a doghouse with the round cut out and it keeps all the light out and then he does this i do the filtering and you could barely see that red thing with what he sent me but i filtered it out i'll, I'll show you another filter 
and most likely it's it's one of the um, you know the ones that obfuscate the light what we see is the big rings and stuff so I'll show you a picture of that for a second um, just to give you a clue okay so watch So, so take in mind that when you see that big round, you know, like rainbow thing with the yellow and pink rim, you're looking at these sky machines that are made for deception to hide. Like right now, if you took that one on the right hand corner and you removed it, you might have actually saw clear planet. But up here, the way Phil's showing you, the sun's on the left, the bright orange, and then, you know, this is filtered. And on the right, he could barely pick that up, but with my with my cams, I could pick that up and show you. It's a spinning circle that's throwing that picture you just seen, like that one right there. See that picture? And I'm taking pictures. I put this stuff up on Facebook, so get on board on Facebook. I give everybody notices that ask me for personal notices, message notice, or I can add it to your Facebook timeline. Anyways, that's what you're looking at there, and I'm going to show you in a minute. There's a principality right there. I'm going to show you in a minute um, basically how many UFOs came together to make that dragon. So you saw you this deception. They're called shapeshifters. They're demonic fallen ones. And, uh, you know, as long as the government's going to worship Baal and have altars in our country, we're going to have this activity and we need to take authority over it and pray. Pray, pray, pray. Right? Serious as can be. Okay, folks, this video is a little bit long, but I want you to stay with me. This is um, the story on the dragon. First, I saw these clouds, and we're in Pastertal, which is, again, up in the Austria area. These cams are awesome. Um, I've seen these clouds coming. They kind of look UFO-y. And then uh, I started seeing these white splotches, and I'm thinking they're stars. But then as I looked at the formation of them, um, I noticed that I don't think they're stars but then the clouds you know I've tried to clear them up too but that's the best they look like air, little arrows anyways they're not stars they could be at, they could be um, satellites from Elon Musk but like that right there looks like a cloud cloaked ship so Keith stay with me I'm not crazy no 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 watch 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 so as I'm watching this thing I'm just showing you as I did it I'm watching it going what the heck's up with these clouds? And then they started changing color. So keep watching. Throw some tunes up. No music. No life. Here we go. So this is the actual no filter on this thing. Uh, just stay with me, all right? You're going to like it.
Now, seriously, don't think all Puff the Magic Dragons are all that nice. As he comes together, it's about a half a dozen UFOs that kind of make this delusion, this illusion, this deception in the sky. So why do I show this? Not to exhort Satan, no. To get you guys ready to say, okay, that's demonic activity. I bind that in the name of Jesus. I take authority over it. That's what I'm doing. Is giving you heads up. Stuff's coming in. Stuff's going to get more weird. A lot of people don't look up. They're not seeing this. But let me tell you, I look up. Because I look up for my where my help, where my salvation comes from. From the spiritual realm. So get ready. God's spirit. You can't understand God in the flesh. He's a spirit. God is spirit. I like to address the ten virgins out there waiting for Jesus Christ to return on the cloud. Now, the reason I show you this is because you should be praying against it, standing up against it, binding it. And, you know, see or see this stuff. I guess this was always my calling. Not that I knew it until five years ago, but um, I didn't believe in UFOs or any of this stuff. But anyways, now that I'm showing you this because I've... I get clear direction where to find this stuff from God himself when I pray. When I don't, I just give you some kind of funny video and you, know, you can tell the difference. But this one, you really got to see. These are UFOs on the horizon here and they're going to just come together and make a shapeshift looking dragon. You know, Puff the Magic Dragon's not that sweet. Anyways, make sure you guys subscribe today. Like, 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 like. Thumbs up because that helps my uh, algorithm or AI to back off. I am shadow banned pretty heavy. I went from 50,000 hits a week to maybe 3,000. So that's shadow banning. But you know, I'm going to keep doing my part, showing the principalities and powers and the planets and how they're hiding the real planets, the real asteroids, and the real meteors. So enjoy. And I'll talk to you later. God bless. Don't miss the end. I got four clips from my skies I want to show you.